Forget about the heat. You make things worse by crabbing about it. Hey, why don't I leave her alone, old sport? That's a great expression of yours, isn't it? What is? Old sport. Why'd you pick it up? Now, Tom, if you're gonna make personal remarks, I'm not gonna stay here for one more second. Mr. Gatsby, I understand you're an Oxford man. No, not exactly, no. Oh, oh yes, I understand you went to Oxford. Yes, I went there. Sure, the man in the funny suit went to Oxford. Tom! I said I went there, didn't I? Oh, I heard you, Mr. Gatsby. I heard you. I'd like to know when. Well, Mr. Gatsby, we're all waiting. It was 1990, I only uh, stayed there for five months, which is why I can't exactly call myself an Oxford man. You see, it was a reward they give to some of us officers for fighting in the war. Ah, I see. So, uh, why don't I make you a drink, Tom, and then maybe you won't seem so stupid to yourself. Wait a minute! I will ask Mr. Gatsby one more question. Please, Mr. Buchanan, please go on. Just exactly what kind of a row are you trying to cause in my house anyhow? Tom! <laughs> Tom, he's not causing a row, okay? You're causing a row. Can you please have some self-control? Self-control? Oh, I suppose the latest thing is to sit back and let Mr. Nobody from nowhere make love to your wife behind my back. Well, if that's the idea, you can count me out. You see, nowadays, people begin by snaring at family life and family institutions. <laughs> that is right. Next thing you know, We'll throw everything overboard and have intermarriage between black and white. Your wife doesn't love you anymore. She loves me. You must be crazy. <laughs> no, Osborne, no, you see, she never loved you. She only married you because I was poor and she was tired of waiting. It was a terrible mistake, but in her heart, in her heart, she knew she never loved anyone but me. No, guys, let's just go home. Stay. No, seriously, we should just hold me. Sit down, Daisy! Come on, Daisy. Daisy, what's been going on? I want to hear all about it. Just told you what's been going on, old sport. It's been going on for five years. You've been seeing him for five years? Not seen. Not seen we couldn't. But we loved each other all that time, didn't we? Oh, that's it. <laughs> You're crazy. I know you didn't get within a mile of her unless you brought the groceries to the back door. All that aside, Daisy loved me when she married me. And she loves me now. No. She does, though. No! She does, though! And what's more, I love Daisy, too. You know what? That's all over now. Daisy, you tell him the truth, that you never loved him, and this will be wiped away forever. Daisy, tell him the truth. Come on, go on. Well, I mean, how could I ever love him, possibly? Well, as our planning, tell him that you never loved him, and all this will be wiped away forever. I... Go on, say it. I... So we can hear. I never loved him. <laughs> Just touch me. Never? No. Not that day at Capulani? Not that time I carried you down from the church bow just to keep your shoes dry? Never? Please don't. <laughs> Daisy, you, you, just, no, just no, Daisy. No. Listen to me, Daisy, please. Daisy, just listen. No, no, Jay. Daisy. Jay, you're listen. asking for too much. Okay, I love you now. Isn't that enough? I mean, yeah, I loved him once, but, but I can't help what's in the past. And, and look, look, I, I loved you too. What do you mean you loved me too, Daisy? Oh, even that is a lie. She didn't even know you were alive. There are things between me and Daisy Gatsby, things that you <laughs> will never know, things you know, I, that I Daisy just, and I can never forget. I just need to speak to her alone. You see, you got it all exciting now, don't you, old sport? Daisy, listen to me, no, please just... No, 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 okay, even alone I couldn't say I never loved Tom. It wouldn't be true. Daisy. Of course it wouldn't. As if it mattered to you. Of course it matters to me. Of course it does. Daisy, darling, I'm going to start taking very care of you from now on. You're not taking care of her anymore! She's leaving. Nonsense! I am, though! No, no, no! She is not leaving me. And certainly, certainly not for a common swingler like you. Mr. Gatsby, exactly who are you anyhow? You see, I've made a small investigation into your affairs. You're one of Meyer Wolfsheim's bunch. Oh. Guys, can we just please go home? You see, he and his Wolfsheim bought a lot of drugstores, you see, and sold bootleg alcohol over the counter. Oh, what 
about it, old sport? Come Don't on. you call me old sport. I'll call you what I want. And this drugstore business is just small range compared to this botch stunt you and Wolfsheim have going on. You know, that's funny, because your friend Walter Chase wasn't too proud to come in on it. I've been giving that lots of thought. How's a reputable banker like Walter Chase end up to his eyeballs in debt? I will tell you how. To a little jerk like Wolfsheim. It's got a greed, old sport. That's right, and you have half the Wall Street out there sweating your free booze at that fun park every weekend. <sighs> I'm surprised. I'm quite frankly surprised that he hasn't tried to drag you into it yet. My God, he has. He has nothing to do with your odd, odd little, little racket. <sighs> Daisy, Daisy, darling, can't you see who this guy is? Or his house, and his parties, and his fancy clothes. He's just a friend for Wolfsheim, a gangster, to sink his claws into respectable men like Walter Chase. Res the only respectable thing about you, old sport, is your money. I have just as much as you, if not more. Which means we're equal. Whoa, whoa, no. We're different from you. I am, they are, she is. It, we're born different from you. It's in our blood. And nothing you can ever do, say, or steal, or dream up. Whatever make a girl on stage. You shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! Shut up! My sincerest apologies. I seem to have lost my temper. Oh, that's right. That speech just off those fine knocks. Listen to me, please, Daisy. No, Look, I, no, I, I, no, okay, I can't take it anymore. Please, Daisy. Daisy. You want one friend? Oh, no, thank you, Tom. I just remembered it's my birthday today. 